Hey y'all, it's Jeff Wiseman with Jeff Wiseman Electric and I've got another LED bulb to show you. This is made by Cree, C-R-E-E. -E. Cree is the flagship manufacturer of LEDs. They just started making light bulbs but before they were just making LEDs. Cree to LEDs is like BMW is to the automobile manufacturers. This is good shit. This was their first light bulb, the 60 watt replacement, which I've got another video online, replaces the regular incandescent 60 watt bulb. Excellent bulb, very nice. I've got a dozen of these around my house. And now they've come out with their BR30, which is your floodlight, which will fit your five inch recessed cans. You can put these in your six inch recess cans if you want, but you can have a little bit of room around there. Or your track lighting or any other fixtures that take a BR30 bulb. Now, let's talk about this bulb. It's got a 650 lumen output, where this one had an 800 watt, 800 lumen output. This uses nine and a half watts. It's ridiculously low. You can leave these lights on shit forever and you're not going to notice it on your light bill. This one here is the 2700K color appearance. That's going to mimic or be as close to your old style incandescent warm light output. It's also available in a 5000K which is going to be a daylight bright, almost a blue color or tint to it, but they're both available. This one here, $19.97. It's about $2 more for the 5000K for those of you that like that bright white light. Now, let me show you one thing I've noticed right away, and I don't know how much it's going to show up on video, but basically there's two parts to these bulbs when they manufacture them. You've got the base that's got all the electronics in it, the heat sinks on here, and then the glass. Now Cree uses glass. They don't use plastic like a lot of the other manufacturers do. But, I don't know if it shows up here, the glass part, when it's inserted into the metal part, is off by about five or 10 degrees. It's cockeyed. It's not level, it's not square, it's not straight or perpendicular or whatever we're looking for. It really does show up in hand and in person. I've had this bulb in for several hours. I've been testing it around my house, putting it through paces on the dimmers. It dims perfectly. Not a problem, it was easy to install. Didn't have a problem inserting it, even being off by a few degrees. Quality control or China needs to pay a little more attention to this. Where this might be an issue for those of you that are using what I call the pull stickers. The extension poles that got a suction cup or the springs on here and you're trying to put this up into a ceiling 12, 14 feet up and you're not using a ladder and your physical hands to feel it going in. You've got a fair chance of setting this in 10 degrees off and cross threading this and getting it stuck up there to where you can't get it out or you can't get it in anymore. So you got to be careful of that if you're using one of those pull stickers. Other than that, glass, it's got a rubber coating around it to keep it uh, shatter resistant. And I like it. I like Cree. I like the manufacturer and everything that Cree's put out so far. I've got Cree flashlights. Uh, if you know anything about Cree, you know they're just the best of the LEDs. And this bulb is right up there, especially at a $19.97 entry point to buying this. Most lighting stores and supply houses, the electrical supply houses, are paying this same price around $19, and then they're marking it up to $29 or more for another brand of LED bulbs. So 
I'm very impressed with this. Now I can tell you, a few months ago they came out with this. Now they've got this. It's only available online today. It's coming to the Home Depot stores, but if you want it today, like I did, you got to order it online. Save the receipt. You're going to need that for the 10-year warranty. That's pretty good right there in itself. But you're going to have to send your receipt, proof of purchase, and the bowl back to Cree for warranty if you need it. What I know is going to be coming out in the next month or two is the BR40, which is going to be your replacement for your 6-inch recess cans and your bigger track lights. They say this is wet location listed, but I wouldn't put this in direct contact with water. So it's got to be underneath an overhang or outside in a recess can or over your tub or over your shower. This will be fine. So anyways, go check this out. It's made by Cree, 10 year warranty, only using nine and a half watts. That's ridiculous. That's low. You can leave these lights on and not worry about the energy consumption. Let your kids leave their lights on when they leave their room and stop bitching at them, okay? Become a good parent. Anyways, go check these out. Available only at Home Depot. And if you got any likes or comments, put it below in the comment section and like it. And please subscribe to my videos because I got more of them coming. This is Jeff Wiseman with Jeff Wiseman Electric. See ya.